I love that sound. Hello, BEA beautiful people, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Maggie Renee, and I am a Juilliard trained opera singer. Do not forget to like, comment down below, and subscribe if you would like to see more reactions to this artist or group. And don't forget to check out the links in my description for perks, benefits, and behind the scenes you don't want to miss. All of my reactions are created live on Twitch during our live stream, so I hope I'll see you at the next one. But for now, let's get into this reaction. Here we go! So this is a really, really beautiful French song. I love it a lot. I sing it not very well, <laughs> but I love listening to it, and I love just the versions that I've heard so far, so I'm curious to see what this sounds like, because this is, oh, this is Bennett again. Okay, so same guy. I'm curious to see how he made this song his own. It'll be interesting to hear, but this is Indila. Adila Sedraya, born in 1984, known professionally as Indila, is a French singer, songwriter, and record producer. She collaborated with many musicians on vocals and lyrics prior to releasing her first single, Dernier Dance. Dernier Dance. I should pronounce that better. Anyways, Last Dance in November 2013, which reached SNEP second in France and became in December 2023, 10 years after its release, the first French language song to exceed 1 billion views on YouTube. Wow. She released her debut album, Mini World, in February 2014. All right. Let's see. Dernier Dance by Indila was the first single off her debut album, Mini World. We review the French lyrics and English translation below and dive into the meaning of the lyrics and some vocabulary from the song. So Dernier Danse is a captivating and enchanting song by the French singer-songwriter Indila released in 2013. It quickly gained popularity across the globe, captivating listeners with its emotional lyrics and haunting melody. This song offers a deep and profound meaning that resonates with people from all walks of life. The lyrics of Dernier Danse allude to the feeling of being trapped in an unfulfilling or toxic relationship. Indila's powerful and evocative voice paints a picture of a person who longs to break free from the chains binding them and dance their last dance. The song beautifully portrays the struggle between love and freedom, capturing the emotions of heartache and the desire for liberation. Indila's lyrics are poetic and metaphorical, inviting listeners to interpret the song in their own unique way. The somber tone of the song further emphasizes its deeper meaning with melancholic undertones that evoke a sense of introspection and reflection. And the lyrics are, Oh my sweet suffering, why do you hound me incessantly? I am just an unimportant person. Without it, I'm a bit lost. I wander alone in the subway, a last dance to forget my immense sorrow. I want to run away for everything to begin again. Oh, my sweet suffering. I move mountains day and night. I dance with the wind, the rain, a little love, a bit of honey. And I dance, 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 dance. And in the noise, I run and am scared. Is it my turn? Here comes the pain. Throughout Paris, I abandon myself and I fly, fly, fly. Nothing but hope on this path in your absence. Try as I might without you, my life is just a beautiful decision display meaningless and then it repeats the chorus in this sweet suffering i paid for all the offenses listen as my heart is immense i am a child of the world and then it repeats the chorus okay i'm very excited to listen to this as i said i really love this song a lot so it's going to be really interesting to see and hear what he does with this here we go this is indila x bennett indila and bennett dernier dance techno mix official lyric video thank you so much luna for sponsoring this video guys let me know what you like and what you don't like and luna let us know if there's anything Anything else we need to know. Here we go. Okay, so far I'm liking it a lot. I think, it's so Bennett's style seems to be to speed up songs to like a 2x kind of a speed, maybe 1.75x times speed, and then add like vocals and move them around, kind of putting them to a different beat and kind of reversing them and having an echo on them, all this kind of stuff. It's cool so far. Let's keep listening. And the kick drum. <laughs> Oh, 
I love that sound. I'm so curious what the difference is between listening to this in headphones versus in like in earphones. Okay, I'm going to listen to this later in earphones, but I'm just saying, y'all, if you haven't listened to this in headphones or listened to techno music in headphones, give it a try because I've never actually done that before. I haven't had the chance to or needed to because we haven't really done many reactions to techno music. And whoa, that is a very different experience. I do have to say because you can literally feel your eardrums shaking. <laughs> that is really cool. I really like the way he does this. It's very interesting. I really appreciate when he goes off the original song a bit, like little solo section that we've been hearing for the past like 10 to 15 seconds right here. I really like that a lot. It shows him as a musician and shows his originality and creation, which I really appreciate. I'm curious what other stuff that he's done and if he's composed any of his own stuff versus just done remixes i would love to hear if he does anything original because it's really fascinating to hear and like i i mean i love this song and i love the original so like i don't have anything negative to say about the song really because it's just like it's a beautiful song she's got beautiful vocals and like i think the way that he's doing this is an interesting interpretation and i like it but like i said i really like the original part where he goes off and does his own thing especially with those strings coming in anyways let's keep on listening <laughs> thing at the end oh that's gorgeous oh my gosh okay i love it i love music like this love listening to it in headphones didn't know that very cool discovery it's so beautiful thank you so 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 much luna for bringing this to the channel i appreciate you tremendously that was really really fun to listen to and i'm glad we're getting to see a little bit more of bennett's skill like i said i want to hear something original by him because i feel like he has some cool creativity in there that he could really make into some beautiful music i don't know Je ne sais pas. I would love to hear it. Thank you so much, Luna! If you enjoyed this video and would like to see another one of my reactions to this artist or group, please don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and comment down below what video I should watch next. Also, be sure to join us on Twitch for our weekly live streams of music, reactions, and more. Don't forget to check out the links down below in my description for exclusive behind the scenes perks and benefits. I am sending you all so, 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 so much love and I will see you in the next video. 